Hi everyone, today I'm going to do the Yankee Candle Tag. This tag was created by DS Yock. Um, first, hi Drew, thanks for tagging me, that was very sweet of you. There are 15 questions, I'm going to copy and paste all of the information into the info box. So if you'd like to follow along or you want to create your own tag video, you may. Number one, why do you love Yankee Candles? Um, the store is five minutes away from my house. That doesn't hurt. But really, I think it's um, just memories with my mom going to the Hallmark store at the time. That was all that sold them here. And um, we would go and pick up votives. And she would light a votive every night on the stove after dinner. So I think it's just a, you know, memories with my mom type of thing. Do you prefer jars or tumblers? Why? Jars. You get your most money's worth out of a jar because it takes a long time to burn through them. Um, I also think the jar is the icon of Yankee. Look at everything that they have. They have the uh, air fresheners, they have even the smaller air fresheners, their lip glosses, all of those things were in the shapes of jars. So I definitely like the jar. Um, tumblers are nice. They do burn faster. They do have a nice even wax pool that they create um, but I burn through them so fast um, but I do like them and they're easy to store but I think the jar is my favorite do you trim the wicks before the first burn why I do not on a jar um, I want to make sure it's not going to drown out and I also want to make sure it gets a nice even wax pool before I do any trimming the tumblers, on the other hand, if the wicks are long, I will trim them. Since there are two in there, they don't need to be as long. And uh, I don't need to make sure that its flames are super um, high just in order to melt all the wax. Hmm, number three, do you prefer votives or tarts? Why? I'm a tart girl. I know you can get votives, especially during the Stampin' Tartpalooza. You can get a votive for a dollar. But I have actually heard from somebody who works for Yankee that they are um, formulated differently than the tarts um, something to do with where the oil is or how much oil I'm not sure but they said that it's not the same so even if you cut a votive in half you're not getting the same amount as what's a tart you might be as far as the wax but not so much the fragrance but if I'm desperate I will do it I've been known like this is grapevine and oak I chopped that guy in half um, and I don't take the wicks out if I'm going to use it I just leave them in there hmm. do you prefer food and spice fresh floral festive or fruit the best the best to me I'm going to have to say is fruit and food and spice I am not so sure about florals I'm still trying to work my way up to actually enjoying some of the florals that I find. Um, festive I think could be in any of those categories even though it would come out in the winter time during Christmas or whatever. Um, I still think that even though it might say festive it might be included in like a food and spice or something like that. Which one do you prefer the least and why? I like I said, I don't care for florals. I think fruit is probably my favorite. Florals is the least. Number five. What is your least favorite size candle? Why? I think the medium tumbler is the biggest waste um, because it's 12.5 ounces. It's less than a medium jar and it's going to burn twice as fast. So for the same price. And it's only $4 cheaper than a jar or a t like a large jar or tumbler and that might be why they are discontinuing them um, really I I'm gonna pay for the large I really don't really buy those small ones unless it's like for five dollars and I really want to try a scent and I don't want to pay full price for one of them and there's no sale going on then I would buy it but other than that large is the only way that I go how often do you visit Yankee Candle on average? Depends. Is it payday? Um, if the semi-annual sale is going on, I go twice a week. If it's not going on, but there's coupons, then I will go visit. It really depends on when I get a coupon. Sometimes I go twice a week, sometimes I don't go for a whole week. Um, 
because I refuse to pay full price for their candles. And even if I had a gift card, I would refuse. Um, what is your favorite coupon? Oh, um, buy two, get two free, buy one, get one free. Um, those are really the only two that I absolutely love. When they have those, they had them in the fall a lot. Um, when they have those, I really buy a lot. Like if it's the buy two, get two, that's the same thing as buy one, get one. And I always know I'm going to buy more than just one. So I will go in and get four candles. I have no problems with that. Sometimes I'll go in there multiple times. When they see me, they see dollar signs. Um, let's see. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite fragrance for the current season? Why? Oh. Now, my favorite fragrance for the current season, I'm going to have to go with a lemonade, whether it be cherry or country. I love country lemonade, but they discontinued it. Um, but I do have my cherry lemonade that is kind of like my backup. So that is my favorite. Um, I like the real tangy lemon scents, as you know. What is your least favorite fragrance for the current season? Why? Um, I don't know. I'm not real big into all these flower scents that came out. Um, unless they have a green note in them. If they come out with something that has a little bit of greenery in it, then I can tolerate it. And I actually will enjoy them. But for the most part, anything floral. Which is your favorite season to burn candles? Why? Um, I'm going to have to say fall or autumn. They come out with some really awesome scents during that time. Um, plus, it gives my air conditioner a little bit of a break. Do you prefer smooth wax or molten wax? Um, I prefer the marbleized wax. Um, I can see where the actual oils are. Um, I'm able to see if it's the right coloring. Is it going to have a lot of fragrance oil or not? And I know that they can be a pain, they tunnel, all of that stuff, but I just like it. It's, it's classic to me, I guess. Um, I don't mind the smooth wax. I buy Perfect Pillars, that's the same thing. But, you know, whatever. If I want it and it's not offered in a jar or in that um, marbleized wax, then I will buy the smooth wax. I really don't care. Do you like doing mixology? If so, what is your favorite? All right, I do a little bit of mixology, but I don't like storing them. And I know other people have said the same thing. Cutting them and storing them is a hassle. And I have got so much um, product already that I don't need to store leftovers. So, um, unless it's something I absolutely have to have every last bit of. If... I'm doing a mixology, more than likely it's in my votive holder, and that way I can just drop all three of them in there, use the whole votive, and then be done. Um, but I don't often buy votives either, so I don't know. Uh, but I do like doing that. I like being able to smell the different creations that you can come up with. Who in your family can you talk to about wax? Um, I can talk to them a little bit about it. My husband absolutely dislikes this. Um, my sister um, asks me some questions that I'm able to answer. Um, my mom a little bit, but I don't like say, hey, I'm going to go to Yankee and buy like six different jars because they would think that's wasting money and, um, you know, you're literally burning your money away. So I, not really anybody. I, I talk to everybody else. Um, number 14, what are you currently burning? Okay, I have to confess. I am, oh, I do have a Yankee going. I have a Yankee going in my bedroom, and it is Napa Valley Harvest. Um, it's one of the wine scents that they had, and I really like that scent. It's different than your typical real um, rich um, wine scents. I like the lighter ones. They're kind of dry, um, fruity. And number 15, tag five people to do this tag. Oh, see, everybody's already going to be tagged. Um, Tempting Treats, I don't think has done hers, but I think Drew tagged her. 
um, oi, 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 um, anybody, 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 if you have Yankee Candles and you've got a lot of them and you feel like you want to do this tag, then you do this tag. Because I love watching these, so definitely I want to be able to see them. I don't want to call anybody out because they may not have a lot of Yankees. You know, they may not even be their favorite brand, so... All right, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed this, and if you have any questions, which I doubt you will, but if you do, please go ahead and leave them down below. Um, and until my next video, take care.